<laughs> Look how he's not even trying, just watching. It's so interesting. Hey everyone, in today's video, we're gonna be doing a watch party analysis of The Influencer, the most recent Korean survival competition show. <laughs> Around their neck is like this collar that shows how many followers they have. Jin Young Jin. I'm gonna lock him up. In round one, two rounds are being conducted. Like a poll. 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 이 사람 이 사람 1대1 좋아하라고 그렇게 따져보면 제 15표를 저한테 투자한 거랑 마찬가지거든요 그럼 문제는 반대표인데 He's just watching everything How would I plan this if I'm producing? I'm trying to think in the perspective of the producer like there's got to be something more like that way of like playing things out and really trying to perspective shift and get into someone's head that's a type of intuition like i don't relate to it's that. very interesting it's really like going what's really going on here there's something beyond what we were seeing and what they've said in order to figure this out i need to think about what is happening in front of me and get into the heads of everybody else. Like the psychology of the people that created this will help me f figure out what is really going on and where are they trying to take this really that's, important. That's a cool example of NI. Simulating so many scenarios so that he could like kind of refine it down to the and one thing. And be prepared. <laughs> This is where things get interesting. Uh oh. Oh, she's about to cry. Oh. Oh my god, that's very pure. I guess to think that you could only, you'd only win through like hard work. Oh. That's cool. Oh. People need to go up and perform. That's what they should just be doing. How, look how he's like not even trying. Just watching. It's he's so watching interesting. Everything. So when N I with F E are trying to look at what's going on, there's a lot of looking at groups of people. There's a vibe here, there's a vibe there, there's an energetic kind of rapport that I'm vibing, and I think this is kind of where it will all lead. But he's not really looking at large clusters of people and their energy and how that will create a macro impact of the social context. Um, he was really trying to look at it more from like, well, what's really going on from a big picture? System that's just perspective. From a whole system that's not necessarily just about feelings, but all Who's of the... Who's most valuable or what are people's actual worth in the system? Yeah, Sensing the mood of a crowd. Huh? <laughs> 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 
인플루언서로서 자질을 보는 거지 않습니까? 싫어요를 yeah. 받는다거나 뭐 좋아요를 받는다거나 그런 거는 상관없이 결국 관심을 받는 거가 목적인 미션이다. 원래 이제 큰 인물한테 가야 돼요. 어그로를 끌려면 그런 분에게 어줍지 않은 지적질을 음... 한다고. 뭐 그랬을 때 가장 그게 큰. Oh my gosh. 네, that's 어떻게 interesting. 배팅하는 게임보. That's interesting how he says that's an intention actually. Like you know that it creates impact to do something like come after people, but it's strategic. Oh my god. 여러분이 받은 좋아요와 싫어요는 인플루언서에 대한 관심과 비례합니다. 좋아요와 싫어요 그 어떤 것도 받지 못해 무관심의 대상이 된 인플루언서는 탈락입니다. <웃음> 작전대로 된것 같아서 기분이 너무 좋았어요. This guy is like a mastermind. Yeah, he's a genius. I mean, the whole time that that challenge was going, I remember thinking, he's gonna lose. What is he doing? He's not trying at all. And then it turns out he's like calculating, calculating all these things. And also, he's taking a he took a gamble. Very big. He gamble. didn't just have a speculation and try to like pre like prepare and protect himself. He actually like went all in, went on stage. He thought about how he could get attention and it was very so strategic. That type of speculating, it's not like I can't speculate like that, but I wouldn't play it out so much and I wouldn't bet on a specific possibility so much. I might brainstorm what's really going on, um, you know, yeah. It could be this, it could be this, it could be this, it could be this. Or it could be none of those things. Okay, whatever. But the way he was like, no. There's something going there's, on there's here. Something. Where are they trying to take us? He acted as if his guess was a reality. Yeah, he was super confident with right. what he saw to a point where he kind of went very like, like if he was, bullish about it. Yeah, if he was wrong, it would have really backfired. But he's like, I'm, I'm going for he it. He went for it. That's it's just kind of so good. genius. Like, it's, it's so many like, this is how things work. And this is what we need to do. So bullish about it and so confident about it, but in this really cool way. Yeah, and very laid back. Like if I found out even one of those plot twists, I would be like, hey guys, hey, hey, I, thought of <laughs> I gotta share with you I the thought information. Of something, I thought of something really interesting. <laughs> and then like the way he's like, no, this is just how things work. I really love how he's a really cool example. If we're guessing, like a really cool example of ENTJs. Yeah. Like, they always look like they're evil, but they have good intentions. <laughs> it's just that they kind of, they're working these things out in their heads and they're kind of also removing the emotions out of it. Really? Right? Really? And going, now's not the time to get emotional. Let's put that away and just figure out how to solve this problem. But there's a lot of like very effortless, like I'm gonna help you guys out. I just need to figure this out. Let me figure it out yeah. and then I'll help you. But it looks kind of like, um, you know, it looks like they don't care or they're being mean, but actually yeah. that's kind of their plot twist way of trying to help and figure out yeah. solving problems with people. I think a lot of people would think he's INTJ because he just looks like he lurks in the background, but he doesn't mind taking gambles and jumping into risks. So extroverted sensing functions like experiences where he has to adjust in the moment it's not really a very like difficult situation for him to adjust to and yeah the very clear introverted feeling in how he he likes to help but almost like the feeling is almost like not even there at all squished down right and even that tiktok girl right you can see she's got a lot of feeling to or... a point where she doesn't even trust that there's like an actual point system that's probably a little more detached I think it's really cool, like, you can see how there's a lot of judging functions, again, when you see everyone trying to make decisions on how, how should I play this game. They're already kind of projecting what they think the way to win it would be. Oh, the way to win this is to be a good person and pick people that you're comfortable with or like. And then some are like, the way to win this is to stay not too high, but not too low. You just want to be in the middle. They're kind of counting or measuring it in their own kind of personal values. There's so many interesting things and we just showed you the first challenge but even in the second challenge you already see even more interesting personality stuff the ways these shows are 
put together. It's genius. Really interesting, like genuinely interesting. Like we just talked for so long just about this one challenge. Really excited to see like what other challenges they have. And then also as the challenges go, we'll get to spend more screen time with specific people. And so mm. if you guys are interested in that, let us know in the comments below. Thanks everyone for watching yeah. and hanging out. ISFJ. Winter, she has a MBTI. I'm going to go to the next one.